Hey everyone and welcome back to some more Dungeons 3. So, let's continue where we left off and let's build some new traps. I already got rotating flamer placed and we can place a few exploding treasure chests. So, let's have a look. We can place one somewhere around here. Maybe in a corner or something like that. There are enemies oh, hold in on. Dungeon. We got some enemies incoming. Let's drop everyone in the guard room. And what about some arrow traps? Oh yeah, we didn't unlock arrow traps just yet, right. How about we do that then? Here. That's only 50. What else can we get? We can unlock the magnetic trap. Okay. It can temporarily nail down heavily armored heroes. Might not be worth it, honestly. Damage done by all automatic traps improved by 50%. Okay, two additional gobblers. I don't think we need that. We got 2000 evilness. <laughs> okay, that's a lot. What else do we have here? I'm just checking all the available options. A heater trap. Okay. Pops up out of the ground whenever an enemy approaches and turns everything into a delicious barbecue. Okay, that sounds promising. We can also unlock complex traps. Some of these sound promising. Okay, let's unlock complex traps. And then what? Vault door, crusher, spring trap. Let's get the crusher. That sounds awesome. And what else? Aim better. Increases range by 8. There are enemies in your Softer dungeon. beds. Improves height of efficiency by 100%. Let's get that one. So, we got 9 more minutes before night time. That's plenty of time. How about exploding treasure chests? Let's place one somewhere around here, for example. Yeah, sure, one over here. And now we also got some arrow traps. Let's place a couple. Where are the most obvious locations? Right here. That's very obvious. And over here. Can't place one right here just yet. Let's dig out some of this. What's the upgrade? Life improvement. Oh yeah, we should use that on... What are they called? The upgraded orcs or whatever. Yeah, this guy. Get over here. Yes, I'm talking to you. There. He got it. Alright, so, traps. There are enemies in your dungeon. More enemies? So there's the crusher. How much space does it require? Let's see. How do we even place it? Can we place it at all? Hold on. We can't place it right now. Alright. Oh yeah, we have no gold. Whoops. Yeah, that would explain it. How about we go and get some? We should build another treasury right here, even if it's not huge. Where can we build a bigger one? Down here. A lot more space down here. Alright. Let's expand this area a little bit. And we'll build a treasury. There's another gold vein on the left, so we can dig through. And maybe build a treasury roughly in the middle. So, something like this. And we can mine them both. Come on, get more gold, faster. I see some gold in here. Not a whole lot, but we can always mine that. Hey, what do you think you're doing? What? Yeah, okay. These guys are getting on my nerves. We need more traps. Heroes are destroying your rooms. Yeah, yeah, it's fine. Enemies have entered the dungeon. We got it under control, I think. 
Yeah, we lost one mana shrine. We need more traps in this area. Let's maybe work on that. And we can buff ourselves up a little bit. Sneaky bastards. Come on, more gold. We need more than 120. Unfortunately, we also need to replace the mana shrine now. Which is only 250 gold, but right now we have almost none. So how about that treasury? That will also cost us a little bit. Fortunately, the treasury isn't very expensive. That will make gold gathering faster. Seriously now? Yeah, drop everyone. What do you think you're doing? <laughs> Maybe we should get the vault doors after all. <laughs> well, it should still be an option. Alright, we still need to kill the dragon lizards. Let's maybe heal up a little bit first. Yeah, the banshee is almost dead. There's the treasury. Let's expand it a little bit more. We need more space. Here, that should do. 450. Now we can use the crusher. Okay, so that's how it works. Let's have a look. Where can we place it? I assume we can place a tar pit in the middle. I don't see why not. So let's say we do something like this. And then a tar pit in the middle. Yeah, that's perfect. We need more of that. A lot more of that. At least one set at every entrance, I would say. So... Over here. Let's maybe gather more gold first. What about our creatures? One more Ironhide. In your dungeon. One more Naga, maybe. More enemies in our dungeon. No problem. We can actually recruit one more. We are at 12 out of 13 at the moment. Let's get one more Naga. For more healing. Wait, do we need another hideout? Already? I think we do, actually. Right, let's just build one somewhere on this side. Since they are all on the other side of our dungeon. 4x4 four four will do. Off you go. And the traps, come on. Get to work. We need the traps. We got three more minutes. And almost 3000 evilness. <laughs> At this rate, we'll be able to unlock just everything. And then get incremental An upgrades. Of evilness is being attacked. Wait, what? Yeah, I don't think I can go and save it right now. You Which one is it? This evilness. one. It's okay. It's not like we need even more right now. We have almost 3,000. Brainwash. Unlocks the Brainwash spell. This makes all creatures in the area of effect forget irrelevant things such as payday, food and the like, okay? Tentacle spell. This can be cast upon free tiles in the dungeon to attack passing enemies, okay? Mada Bomb. Undead Rise. Summons skeletons and zombies for a short time. Okay. Enemies have entered the Frost dungeon. bomb temporarily freezes all enemies. I like that one. I actually like that one a lot. Let's test that one. Yep, even more enemies. Like I said, we need more traps in this area. Can we research the vault door? I think we're going to need yet another... Yeah, lecture hall. Yep. In fact... The lecture hall needs to be a multiple of 3x3. 
because that's how much the lectern takes. Three by three. Which means this room is not very optimal, let's just put it that way. Soon, night would fall. We can make it a little bit better. So this will give us enough space for one more lectern. How's gold coming along? Let's expand the treasury a little bit. So that they won't have to go too far. And night is coming in 40 seconds. So first, let's expand this a little bit. Lecture hall. Where was it? Right here. And it should be automatic. There's no need to build it ourselves. Okay, sounds good. I would still like a few more traps. So how about a trap right here? The crusher. At least one crusher and a tar pit. Possibly two, but let's get one first. And what about more arrow traps? Oh, days like these are hard on the nerves. We'd be better one arrow trap over here on the other side of that the spike traps. Like a great plan. Yet the underground wasn't necessarily safe. Maybe those sneaky little heroes still had an ace up their sleeves. And just what is that supposed to mean? <laughs> yeah, what is that supposed to, to mean? So vague. All of right, let's course. go. This is the Not much point I waiting. We we'll leave mean, any wounded creatures in here. If I were just oh, did you die? Everything right now. That's Extremely unfortunate. Unboring. Just go with it. No. Spiders Wait, what does that mean the then? Underground. Okay, whatever. So, who's wounded? Oh, none of them are wounded. What does this skull mean exactly? I'm not seeing it. Oh, I think that means he needs beer. Right, we never actually built that. That's a bit of a problem, yes. Let's build it in here, maybe? That was supposed to be a hideout, but whatever. We need a brewery. How much will that cost us, exactly? 25 per tile. Okay. Anyway, let's go outside. Oh, that's a lot of gold and an upgrade. What's that? Positive payday. Epic. Let's give it to the level 5 guy, perhaps. Where is he? This dude, for example. Here. Now? I think he already has an upgrade. Alright, time to go. Brian. We'll send mostly everyone, I think. And let's get that brewery done really quick. Here, that will do. And we'll dig out another room. In case we'll need a hideout or something like that. I think we might need another hideout. 4x4 four four will do. Okay, time to go. We can leave a few creatures inside. So let's say one Naga can leave. I want Thanos's head. Uh, zombie, you can stay inside. I am the queen of evil. One Imp. Right, I don't want to waste too much time on this. Here, you go back inside. Come on. I want Thanos' head. I am the queen of One banshee. Evil. Good will fall. This is probably fine now. Alright, let's go. We don't have too much time. Nine minutes. Which way do we go? This is a dead end. Never mind. This way, I suppose. We can also still unlock more creatures. So how about we do that? And hired something. Let's hire Ironhide. And off we go, this way. Do we break the gate? I guess so. I mean, they are sleeping. So it's not like it matters. We can also test the frost bomb. Looking forward to it. Holy crap, that gate is really tough. It's a reinforced gate. We might also break it, though. It's payday. Then we can actually get into the city. It's already at half health, it's fine. We can upgrade Thalia too. Or not. Not enough gold, never mind. 
I thought we'd have more gold, honestly. We can still get more snots. They need to work harder. Here, we're in. Let's use that frost bomb, shall we? There is a turret, no problem, we'll destroy it. And we can buff ourselves up, as usual. Can't go wrong with that. This guy looks tougher. Yeah, it's a stone guard. Didn't help him too much, did it? Nope, it did not. We need to be getting more gold. And yep, yet another one. We can probably lure that group towards us. How tough are these towers? It's an improved cannon tower. Well, alright then. Fair enough. We should still destroy it. Maybe back up slightly once we do. We aren't really taking that much damage, or at least we are healing through it just fine. Yeah, we are doing just fine. Oh yeah, we do have the shrapnel cannon. Do we have to trigger it manually or something? I guess so. Weird. Okay, buff up. Maybe back up with the Banshee. Send it back to the dungeon. That sounds reasonable. It's almost dead. Technically, it was already dead to begin with. We'll kill the ranger and then get out of here. Our goal is to kill defenders. We can pretty much ignore the cannons. There, alright, let's get out of here. Go kill more dudes elsewhere. Banshee back into the dungeon. And everyone else will stay outside. This group should be more than enough still. We got six more minutes. Plenty of time. We can try to get the fountain back, but we really don't need it, honestly. We got more evilness than we'll need at this stage of the game. Drop the frost bomb. Goodbye. Okay, looks good. Let's check our brewery real quick. Here. That will do. And carry on. We still got the buff. And a lot of spare mana. That's a ballista, but a simple one. Less health on that one. We can probably just destroy it pretty quickly. Don't wake up that group on the left, though. Buff up again. No reason not to with that much mana. We got five more minutes. Should be enough time. Twenty-four defenders left. Thanos must die. Here, frozen. Nice. I like that trap. What do you want me to do? We don't even need the fireball from Thalia. <laughs> then again, we might as well use it. Oh no, it's on cooldown now. Command me. These guys look a little bit tougher. Come on, try harder. I knew you'd need me. 67. So, basically around half. There, he's down. And we can destroy the tent I'm while the we're at it. Yeah, we don't need another hideout, I knew it. Well, that's okay, we'll just build it in here. You happy now? <laughs> Here's your hideout. You can go sleep. Oh, nice, a buff. Critical hit bonus, okay, we'll just grab it on the hit first orders. creature. And start with the frost bomb. Go. 4000. Yeah, we definitely don't need more fountains. 
three more minutes. We'll just go all the way south and kill everything on the way. Then re-enter our dungeon using the southwest entrance. Also, enough money for some more upgrades. First, more creatures and maybe more snots. Might as well, they will get gold faster. Come on, chop chop! We don't have much time left. We can almost kill the entire group before they get a chance to do anything after they get frozen. So how do we go back south? Oh, I think we have to go all the way around. Looks that way, so never mind the plan. We'll have to use the other entrance. Alright, that's fine. Yeah, the only way is through the city. Not sure if we have enough time to destroy anything else. We'll try. So, back in, come on. Hurry up! We don't have much time. Just two minutes left. Level six now. Alright, let's send everyone. Well, maybe almost everyone. We don't need literally all of them. That will do. The rest will stay inside. What do you want me to do? Okay. Any defenders in the area? Maybe this way? Yes, there's a group. We can kill at least that group. We have enough time. One minute. That's just about enough time to kill that group the right there. Would soon rise. Yeah, yeah, we know. Thanks for the update. There is a turret here, but that's fine. It's a simple one. What do you want me to do? We can just ignore it, I think. Maybe destroy the hero's hall. Do we have enough time? 40 seconds. We have enough time, yes. Alright, back we go. We need to wait for another night. We got 54 defenders left. I'm not even sure where exactly they are. <laughs> if we really hurry up, we might be able to kill all 54 during the next night. But we'll really have to hurry up with that. So, back in. And let's maybe place a few more traps. I definitely wouldn't mind. So, first of all, a few more crushers. It was morning. One over here and a tar pit. Where else do we need them? This one is ready. This one's ready as well. So, that's one crusher at each entrance right now. We could also place one. Can we remove a trap? I assume we can. We don't have any beer, really. What's the brewer doing? Work faster. Maybe we need to make it a little bit bigger. Yeah, we should have made it just a little bit bigger. That's fine, we can expand it slightly. No problem. This will be enough for one more unit. Get to work. We can still hire one more creature. So, that will do. There are enemies in your dungeon. Yep, enemies coming already. One more snot, two more snots. And let's take care of the enemies. Where are they? Right here. Just drop everyone into the guard room. They didn't take as much damage as I thought they were. Okay. Never mind. Here's the second kettle. 
that should make enough beer, hopefully. We have more than enough gobblers and more than enough toolboxes. So at least that's not a problem. What do we want to recruit? We can still get one more. In fact, we can get five more, technically. But let's watch our gold. So how about... One more Gobobot, one more Imp. We don't have some upgrades for Gobobots, let's get one more. Speaking of upgrades, let's have a look. What do we want to get? We can still upgrade the Nagas, increase their range. We do have some high level Nagas, let's upgrade them. Any more interesting traps? We got the Vault Door, Spring Trap, Heater, Magnetic Trap, the damage done by all automatic traps improved by 50%. Let's get that one. We do have quite a lot of automatic traps actually. So that works. There are enemies in your dungeon. More enemies. And there's the Naga upgrade. Oh, same exact entrance. <laughs> you came to the wrong neighborhood. I'm just saying. We might also buff everyone up. Because why the heck not? And freeze the enemies. Because also why not? We have a lot of mana. More than 1000. Payday. How about we go and kill these dragon lizards? I think it's about time to kill them. We've been waiting long enough. Maybe freeze them. Yeah, they are going down pretty damn quickly. And there's an unlimited source of gold in here, in case we'll need that. We might also mine all the other gold. And go kill the spider too. And mine all of this gold. Goodbye. So, what else? How about another lecture hall? So, it should be free by free, which means we could build it like so. Sounds good. And build a connection here. There are still so many upgrades we can get. Exciting guard duty. Reduces your creatures increase in needs by 50%. Okay. That's not too bad. Throne room. Now. More zombies. Loud screamers. Your banshees become even louder. Now you need to yell to communicate. <laughs> Increases their range by 50%. Okay. Arcanium increased mana capacity. What about some more spells? I like spells. Create gobblers. No, we don't need that one. Complex spells. Brainwash, tentacle, mana bomb, undead rise. Create magic mines that automatically explode when enemies approach. Let's get Undead Rise. And what else? Defend mana Shield. All affected creatures are protected from damage, which instead hits the shield. I like that. So we'll get these two and test them. Next time we get a chance. Wait, what? Seriously? What do you think you're doing? Where did they even come from? I didn't notice them coming, but alright. So, let's expand the lecture hall. Just in advance. And we have more than enough beer, like I said. Are you dead yet?
bit more gold over here in the corner. We can still explore. I don't expect to really find much, but hey, who knows? There's a little bit of mana we can mine. Five more minutes. There's still one more sun temple somewhere, but that's a bonus objective. Let's grab more creatures. So two more, and what do we want to recruit? One more banshee won't hurt. And maybe one more imp. More demons won't hurt. Make the vortex more useful. I wonder when we're going to get more demons. Or more undead. There are still a lot of creatures that we haven't seen. There are four each in every row. At least I assume there will be four each. I suppose we'll find out. I mean, I could always look in the Almanac creatures. So yeah, demons. There are four each. Demons, horde. Yeah, there's an ogre. And undead. Grave golem, that sounds promising. The ogre looks pretty good. Pit fiend. So, four minutes. Let's check the upgrades. Gold looks fine. Enemies have entered the dungeon. Oh, more enemies. Will they go through here? Yep. Alright, no problem. We got a welcoming committee. Should probably just build a guard room in here. Like this, for example. I don't know. And more traps. You guys done yet? Rip. That exploding treasure chest is a little bit too far away, I think. Yep, seems that way. So how about we remove one of the spike traps and replace it with a crusher? Let's have a look. Yeah, crusher instead. And a tarpid. Here. That should be a little bit better. Now, we could place an arrow trap. In fact, we can optimize this area a little it's bit more. Payday. So... We can do something like this. If they want to go through here, just let them. I'm okay with that. And we might as well build a guard room in the corner. Not sure how useful it's going to be, but... We might as well build it. Actually, no, don't fill this space. And now we can place an arrow trap. Facing the corridor. Perfect. And a guard room. Much better. So, two more minutes. Less than two minutes, in fact. And we can remove that exploding treasure chest, I suppose. We don't exactly need it anymore. Maybe place another crusher. Nah, we're good. Let's take one more look at the upgrades. How many creatures of each type do we have? We got four iron hides, but there are no more upgrades for them. We got four gobobots, three imps, and three banshees. Okay then. The banshees had some upgrades, I think. Soon, night would yeah, increases range by 50%. Sure, we can get that. Forty seconds. We can probably already leave. Let's get our group ready. Because 
Actually, we can take everyone, I think. There's no need to take everyone. Enemies we'll just take the all the strong creatures. So all the high levels. Like that, and leave the low levels inside. Sounds reasonable. Yeah, the Imp, the Gobobods, the Nagas, Talia. The rest can stay inside. The dungeon heart is being yeah, yeah, attacked. it's fine. Calm down. It was night. Here, it's fine. Don't worry. All good. In fact, we should grab a few more. This is overkill. Here, have a bath. Don't die on me. Okay, who's still inside the dungeon? Just checking. Let's grab the imp. And the other imp. Okay, that will do. Let's go. It's night time. I will destroy That's a pretty this good map. group. We got 54 more defenders to kill. Oh, hold on, we are also running out of gobblers, really? Well then, no problem, we'll Those build a, a quick farm. I sent to scout around. Somewhere in here or something. We should free them. Then I can yeah, just, let's just build a quick failing. gobbler farm. Great plan. Although it looks like those guards are full to the eyebrows with caffeine. None of them are going to be sleeping tonight. Oh yeah, let's summon and some undead. And we can try the mana shield, just to test new spells. Yeah, the mana shield is going to be super useful from the looks of it. How's that gobbler farm? Hurry up! The all-crushing evil simply plowed right through the Ironhide's weedy guards. Thoroughly impressed, they happily join the evilest of all evils, evils army. All right, onwards. Simply Fifty more enemies. I'm not sure if we can kill that many in one night, but Saying we'll try. Something like that now is rather amusing, considering that in the future. Ah, yes, on I we go. Rest. Just build a gobbler farm go. real quick. That will do. Okay, don't attack yet. I want a mana shield. Here. Now you can go. We probably didn't even need that. They just die almost instantly. 46 more. They are a little bit too spread out. We need like a few big groups. Oh yeah, that's the Sun Temple. Can we destroy it easily? Ish? Yeah, maybe. Let's give it a shot, I suppose. Yeah, these turrets are slightly irritating. Do we stay here to destroy it? Shouldn't take too long. Then again, we only have 9 minutes. 41 enemies remaining. I wonder how hard it would be to kill them during the day. I mean, they are stronger, but they aren't unkillable during the day, I assume. Well, bonus objective is done. Of course, they had a completely different set of problems. We could have ignored that second turret, I suppose, but whatever. We destroyed it anyway, because we could. the way it looks. Onwards, I see another group up there. Come on, chop chop, let's go. I wish I could contradict you, but we got we eight minutes really aren't suited to, long stays to kill 39 enemies. Unless we use a protection Wait, do turrets actually count as defenders? Fire? Yeah, but they would buy it all up. Damn vampires. Yeah, they do. Okay, good to know. I assume they don't. Apparently I was mistaken. We still got 1,000 mana. Okay, 33 more. It's going to be close. Ish. Where can we still go? I'm not even sure anymore. West? Let's destroy this gate, maybe.
Come on. Just so we can move through. And we'll destroy the turrets, since they do count as defenders. I think there are some enemies in this area. I mean, guarding the fountains. There have to be some over there. Someone has to recapture the fountain. It didn't recapture itself. That mana shield is pretty damn good. And one more turret over there. 31. We'll just wreck this city. Seven minutes left. That's the last one, I think. Yep. We still got the hero's fortress. Should probably get rid of that. Here. And hero's fortress. Let's just destroy that while we are here. Yeah, it will go down faster than the cannons. And southwest. I think most of the defenders are in that area. There's also a town in the corner. Probably a lot of defenders there. We'll leave it for last, I think. Oh wait, no, let's go there first. That's actually closer. That's much, much closer. Six minutes. 28 defenders left. Let's see if we can make it. Let's buff ourselves up. Okay, and let's go. Maybe destroy the cannon first. Both cannons, preferably. This looks like a pretty big town. It might have most of the defenders that we still need to kill. Okay, one down, one more. Come on, hurry up. Oh, we woke them up. Actually, no, just one. Okay, go. And then the gate. And keep ourselves buffed. Looking good. Now smash the gate. We can't summon undead inside. Ah. Uh -huh. I thought we might be able to. That would have been funny. We are still low on gobblers, really. That's interesting. I mean, I guess we can get more. But I'd rather focus on the outside at the moment. We can build a gobbler farm here. Yeah, zero again. We can upgrade the gobbler farm. Here, I suppose that will help. Come on, move! We got a cannon. Yes, destroyed. Hurry up. We only got four minutes left. Not a lot of time. Thirteen more enemies. Are there enough in this town? No idea, maybe. Okay, let's freeze these dudes and just kill them right away. Six more. We're going to be, like, free short. From the looks of it. Yeah, we are going to be exactly free short. So basically one group somewhere on the map. We still have three minutes. Oh, I think there are a few over here. Seems that way. There's the turret. We'll destroy the hero's fortress. And let's go get the last group. Okay, let's go. Yeah, this is going to be the last group we need. Right? Or what? No, that's just a tent. There's a turret down here. 
I think we need to go back. It's we just don't have a whole lot of time. Let's check out the fountains. There should be some groups over there. It's just that they don't always count as defenders. No, we have literally one target left. That's going to be the turret. That's it. We just need to go through the city. We got two minutes left. I assume we can just stay outside during daytime now. Probably won't be needed though. We'll get there. Come on guys, faster. Chop chop. What are you waiting for? Move it. Let's unlock some spell before we finish. Then again, it's not like we're going to use it. Oh hey, we can just get gobblers like this. First we would have to research that. And we are done with more than one minute left. I assume that will be the end of it. Let's find out. Lakesville was no more. Once again, Talia and the indifferent evil's armies left a trail of destruction behind them. Kind of surprising that Tanus hadn't tracked them down yet. They should name him Worst Tracker of All Time. <laughs> yeah, that's true enough. He never was one to pay attention to detail. Details like a burning city? Yeah, he's more of a big picture guy. Pretty soon he's going to be a picture of my dagger in his eye guy. Oh, you are so brutal. On a different note, is this day-night cycle thing permanent now? No, because that was just because those sun temples made the days just fly by. Oh, Sounds legit. I thought that was the fresh sea air. Um, that too, yes. Lakesville was no more. Now it was time to set sail for Termite Island. There to face the mighty Yaina Overproud. Yaina Overproud, <laughs> okay, if you say so. Well, victory, that's the end. Let's see what's going to be next. The Prince of Hell, Prison and Skeletal Archer. Sounds promising. However, that's going to happen in the next episode. Thanks for watching this one. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like if you did or a dislike if you didn't. And I'll see you next time.